Former India cricketers Venkatesh Prasad and Akash Chopra have been going head-to-head -head over their perception of KL Rahul. While Prasad has been a staunch critic of Rahul, questioning his place in the Indian Test team amid repeated failures, Chopra went on to call Venkatesh an agenda paddler over his criticism of the batter. Now, Harbhajan Singh has jumped into the debate calling the duo to leave Rahul alone. Taking to Twitter, the former India off-spinner wrote, Can we leave KL Rahul alone guys? He hasn't done any crime. He is still a top player. He will come back strong. We all go through such patches in international cricket. He is not the first one and last one. So please respect the fact that he is our own player and have faith. Earlier, Prasad had fired shots at Chopra for calling him an agenda peddler in a 12-minute video where he critically dismissed the points that the former India pacer had made over KL Rahul's selection. Prasad had written, I have no agenda against any player, maybe there are others who have. Difference of opinion is fine but calling contrary views as apna personal agenda and Twitter par Matt Laie is funny for cricket Akash, considering he has made a great career by airing his views. I have nothing against KL or any other player, my voice has been against unfair selection and different yardsticks for performers. Be it Sarfaraz or Kuldeep, have voiced based on merit. But it was disappointing to see Akash calling it personal agenda. In reply, Chopra said, Wayne ki bhai, message are getting lost in translation. You hear, me on YouTube. I invite you to come on a video chat, we can do it live. Difference on opinions is nice. Let's do it properly I'll not have any sponsors on it and nobody will make money out of it. Up for it? You have my number. However, Prasad dismissed the idea, saying, nothing is lost in translation, and he doesn't wish to engage with him on the topic anymore. No Akash, nothing is lost in translation. In your 12-minute video you have called me as an agenda peddler because it didn't suit your narrative. It is crystal clear. And I have made my points very clear in this Twitter thread. Don't wish to engage with you further on this, he said. With KL Rahul no longer India's designated vice-captain in the test format, there are high chances that he would be dropped from the playing 11 in the third test against Australia.